I've chosen a great weekend to be in Ilfracombe. It's their annual open, a tradition here since 1983. At the end of a long day, I spoke to President and Local Councillor Tony Nielsen about the Open, hay bales and Rugby League. We've got 52 players today, which is, which is good because, because we're only a nine hole course. If, if we get more than, say, 64, 65, we, we, we get a big hold up at half time. What you would have seen today, it, it, everything flowed pretty well, there was no hold ups. Yeah. Oh, Hewenden, Longridge, Gulfocane, Mutterborough, Bark Alden, Alpha, and, and Blackall, you know, we, we, we had players from all those towns. The first few holes on the course are in the wide open spaces and are relatively easy. When you get to the fourth though, you begin a three hole stretch over creeks and through thick Gidgee country. It seems that getting past these holes relatively unscathed is the key to a good round here. Well, this year's been a good year uh, season-wise, and we had a lot of grass here. Peter McClellan, he's, he's a hay cutter around town. He, he, he's just a, a local. But he cuts the bar for uh, cost price, and, and, and we, we sell it. We make $20 a bale, actually, and, which is really great for us. We got 159 bales this year, so that's over $3,000. We can break even without that, but that, that is a big boost to us, I'll tell you what, and, and he offers that every year for us, eh? Thank you. So we all try and support each other's open, because, because that's our money day for the year. We get all their nominations, they drink a few beers and that, and, and every club depends on it, because we, we struggle a bit, it's just not, not that easy, you know, and, and we're a country, we, we're, we're not, um, we've got a lot of things that, you know, that, that bring us all together. The race, race meeting is one of them, and the Anzac Day is another one, and, and football is another one, because last night we had a bloody great, great crowd over there, but anyway, we lost, and that's another bloody story. But we, we thought this was our year, actually. We, we just lost to Witten last week by two points. We would have the grand final here, and, and it would have been great, but it didn't happen. Yeah, and, and, but it was a good game. The boys didn't let us down. So.